Well, summertime is filled with lots of opportunities to be out in the sun, which is fantastic. Um, but the UV rays are very strong, so it's very important to wear some sort of eye protection like sunglasses. And you don't have to go out and buy a $400 pair of glasses. There are plenty of $30 to $40 glasses uh, that work well. What you're looking for is you're looking for UVAB protection. Um, that helps with not only protection of the actual eye, um, but little known that the skin around the eye is a very big hot spot for small little cancers to develop over time. That's a tough area because you don't use sunscreen on those areas and such. And so very important to get um, nice big sunglasses. And also, even on a cloudy day, you still want to wear UVAB protection um, because the sun can still come and create issues over long term. It's also been a discussion about polarized versus not polarized. So with polarized sunglasses, um, the way that the optics are of the lens, um, it helps reduce glare. But the problem with polarized glasses that we find is there are many things that actually go with those rays. And so, for example, your iPhone or your iPad, if they are um, sort of anti-glare as well, you will actually lose the ability to see it. And I catch people on the beach or at the pool with their sunglasses on top of their head because they're trying to read their iPad. And so actually, I have a pair of polarized sunglasses and a pair of non-polarized sunglasses. And that way, if I'm on the beach and want to play with my cell phone or read my iPad, I I can put my non-polarized on and, and I've got sun protection going on. Summertime is fun for outdoor sports, um, but outdoor sports also mean a time where we see the most eye injuries. And so if you're wearing your sunglasses, say you're out you know, playing frisbee, say you're out golfing, it's very important to wear some sort of protection. We always say that when it comes to different um, equipment and different balls, the smaller the ball, the more harsh the injury actually. So a basketball or something hitting your eye is not going to cause as much damage as say a ping pong or a golf ball. But if you have eye protection, if you have some big sunglasses, that'll help um, protect the eyes from any sort of object that comes towards you. Um, and we certainly see increased risk of uh, injuries, especially in kids in the summer. So we like to really tell parents to make sure that your kids are wearing the sunglasses. We want them to think that sunglasses are cool, sunglasses are trendy, um, that way they're more likely to wear them in their teens and beyond. Um, it's tough sometimes to keep sunglasses on, so we understand little toddlers may not be able to keep them on. In that case, something like a visor or a hat that has a, um, some sort of string around there is probably the best. Um, because like I tell people, sunglasses are never going to protect you if they're on your forehead or if they're in your bag. They have to be on your face covering your eyes.